For the first step, you want to head over to search and then type in Windows Defender Firewall. Click on it. Now once you're on this, you want to click on Advanced Settings. And then you want to click on Inbound Rules. And then click on New Rule. And then you want to click on Port. And then click on Next. And then click on UDP. And then in this box right here, you want to type in 49152-65535. Click on Next. Click on Next again. Click on Next again. And then just put the name as Valorant. The name doesn't really matter. And then click on Finish. Now for the second step, you want to head over to Search again and type in Firewall and Network Protection. Click on it. Now once you're on this, you want to click on Allow and App Proof Firewall. And then you want to click on Change Settings. And then click on Allow another app. And then click on Browse. Now you want to find your Valorant game file. So for me, it's on my C drive, Program Files, Scroll Down, Riot Games, Valorant, Live, Shooter Game, Binaries, Win64, and then you want to find the Valorant Win64 EXE file. You want to double click on it, which will then make it appear here. And then click on Add, which will then add it to this. And then click on OK. Now for the next step, you want to head over to Search again and type in View Network Connections. Click on it. Now once you're on this, you want to find your network adapter, either Ethernet or Wi-Fi. No matter which one you have, you want to double click on it. And then click on Properties. And then click on Internet Protocol version 4. And then you want to make sure that use the following DNS server address has been selected. You want to make the first line 8888 and you want to make the second line 8844 and then click on OK. Now for the last step, you want to head over to search again and then type in CMD. Then you want to run it as administrator and then click on Yes. Now once you're on this, we're going to type in ipconfig space forward slash flush DNS and click on Enter. Then we're going to type in netsh space windsock space reset and click on Enter again. Now once you complete all the steps in the video, you want to restart your computer and then the problem should be fixed.